Okay, so you may have seen this on social media, dogs using buttons to talk to their owners. An animal communication study by UC San Diego and other institutions is testing if this actually works and how it can be used. CBS 8's Alex Lai shares the first findings and what the dogs are saying. You know your dog is smart, but have you ever wondered why they're barking or even what they're thinking? This new study finds that dogs can actually communicate using symbols on a soundboard. Do you want the dinner from last night? Yes, yes, hungry, treat. So we know dogs understand treat. words. We know that we can train them treat. with some commands. Okay. The question was, treat. can they use this kind of symbols to communicate back to humans and to ask for things? UC San Diego is taking the lead on trying to answer that question. Treat. Federico Rossano with UCSD's Department of Cognitive Science shares the study's first findings. That is the product of 21 months of tracking 152 animals in their own homes. Um, and we have a data set of 250,000 button presses. Owners teach their dogs what the different buttons mean and track the number of presses for each one. They push more food and treat and outside and play then I love you or the name of the owner. So far, data shows dogs are able to communicate their needs, wants, and internal states. It's a step in breaking the language barrier between dogs and humans. When you're scratching the door, is it because they just want to go outside for a walk or is it because they need to pee or is it because like sometimes you don't know many pet owners are familiar with the frustration because now they can tell you instead of barking at you <laughs> the findings released are part of a larger study we have 10,000 participants from 47 countries right now in the studies and if that isn't cool enough the results go farther than dogs asking for things we now have several dogs that have learned the concept out to communicate about pain we were getting clips saying belly ouch and then they would puke or saying ear ouch and then they go to a veterinarian and they have an ear infection. Rosano says mixed breed dogs are performing the best in the study and younger dogs are learning quicker. Each dog has a different number of buttons. Most have around 20. There's two dogs that have 150 buttons. This is just the beginning of trying to learn what dogs are capable of. Can we actually understand what they're excited about, what they're frustrated? Can they communicate about what they're experiencing? If you want to test your pet's skills, the study is open to more participants. And it's not just dogs, there's also 700 cats. Treat, 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 treat. Or you can come to the Dog Cognition Lab at UC San Diego. You know, playing some games and for us to tell you how smart your dog is. Find the sign-up link and more information at CBS8.com. Alex Lai, CBS8.